back at it. Duskmorn drafts. Goal is to beat a three-three. We just we need we need a, a four-three win. You know, something a little more positive. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. I was about to say there's only two of us queued up, and is it gonna be a long time for drafts? No, not today. During Innocence, what a good start. What a really good start. Man, it really, really sets us up to kind of want to look at the Boros stuff. This is good pack one, pick one. Good rare. Followed up by Toby Bestie Befriender, huh? I know it's beastie. I like calling them the besties though, because they really are. Like all of the beasties feel really good. That's that's insane. So, creature tokens I control have flying. If I have four or more creatures, so I want to be on one to look out for the uh, the twins. Doing the thing and manifesting. Getting to play like Toby and the twins is gonna be crazy good. Cause he makes a body, yeah, that's gonna be crazy. What is this? If a source you control will deal non-combat damage to a permanent or a player while there are four more card types among cards in your graveyard, it deals double that damage instead. When it enters, it deals X damage to each of up to X target creatures. This thing seems insane. Roller Crusher Ride. Right? Like, rare, rare, mythic. You're, you're Boros. Like... It's a lot of three drops, you know. Grand entryway, elegant rotunda is a good pickup for us. Painter servant wouldn't be a bad, or yeah, painter studio, painter servant. <laughs> um, man, I kind of just want to grab the white card since we're already more white. We might splash in a different direction we might not be able to pick up a bunch of red cards but we'll, we'll see i'm not against this this is this is really good i feel like if i want any kind of delirium anything boros this clockwork percussionist is good found footage might make it just for delirium See, the Unwilling Vessel is also good. We could go the blue-white enchantment route. Uh, I think I might take the monkey here since we already have the Roller Crusher ride. I could see that, that other card, yeah, because then we would have gotten Fear of Falling, which is also really good for that. Agrimaw, Friendly Ghost has been really good. Diversion Specialist, not really. The Ghost still triggers off of the Innocence as well. Uh, as fun as Fear of Falling is, it's a really good card. We're, we're just gonna, we're gonna take the cards on our colors. Oh man, the turn inside out, that's gonna be so good for us. Glimmer Light's a good card here. We're going to take the, the turn inside out, though. Is that a second friendly ghost? That's great. That is great. Um, we're not really playing anything here, so we're just going to take the rare to set complete. That's my fourth rare of that ley line, so... 
That's nice. Um, yeah, I'm not really looking to play any of this. Uh, try to not play Impossible Inferno if I can help it. I might just take the mask for the uncommon. Try and get some of those gems back. Speaking of railroading, I mean, I got past rare, rare mythic. Like, can you blame me for feeling like that's my seat? I don't like drafting like this, but if somebody's just gonna hand me a Boro stack, like, I'm not against playing it, you know? Get in the minecart, yeah. Okay, at the end of the pack where we don't really see anything that's doing what we want to do. Oh, the found footage might see play just to help me get delirium. Surveil to put this in the graveyard. You hit a land and an enchantment creature, you're a delirium. Oh man, rewarded. Hover ship, fear of abduction. Like turn inside out, percussionist. This is this is all stuff and there's another grand entryway. We're taking the hover ship here. Absolutely. Removal that just leaves behind a 2 2 vehicle. Um, time leaves all right. Ooh, Delirium, the hand that feeds. It's going to be a good pickup for what I'm looking to do. See, Gremlin Tamer would be a really good speculative splash. This card's inside. I might actually just pick this up. We might splash the, the Gremlin Tamer if we can. That's such a good card. Looking to help splash. There's the Piggy Bank. But Midnight Mayhem, just making Gremlins, is, is super good for the little guys that we're looking to play. We might just take the Gremlins here. As much as I like the Piggy Bank, the Slayer, the Gremlins. Right? It's the Gremlins. But just all of our enchantments, all of a sudden coming with a 1 1 token. That could be really good. You know, I only got, what, one other room right now? I don't really see us pivoting into the room stuff. I don't see us going green for Delirium either. We might just take Terramorphic here for the mana fixing. Otherwise, the best card in the pack is definitely the Smoky Lounge, Misty Saloon. Like, it's really good. But I don't know that we have enough rooms. I'll take the Terramorphic for my, my blue splash here. Unwilling Vessels, looking pretty good. There's the Twins that I was looking for. This is actually really great for our deck. If we can get out Enduring Innocence and play a Twins, that's make two two twos and draw two cards for four mana, which is crazy good. I don't really want the Orphans of Wheat. We're already up on the Ghosts. A Glimmer Light would be cool here too. I think we take the Twins though. I'm pretty sure attack, sacrifice, permit. If we do draw a card. Interesting. Honestly, it's probably just fear of surveillance. It's an enchantment for our eerie triggers. It's a white, our main color. It's a good two drop. Another hand that feeds. Excellent. I mean, we're already splashing blue. Well, what's a little more, huh? That that might make the cut, honestly. Ooh, 
percussionists are inside out here. That is a tough decision. You really think so, huh? Inside out arena? You think that's what I should take? Alright, I'll let Arena decide that one. This one, we want the other hand that feeds. If this wasn't here, I'd just be taking the, the rare, but... Let me get a percussionist anyway. Good call, Arena. Um, we might play this on three. It manifests a 2-2. Two, two. We don't really have the rooms for you, good sir. And then we can sacrifice it. We don't really need to unlock that. Um, you're all I need collected. So we're not even looking there. Uh, there is really nothing for us in here, huh? No splash, no playable card, like... Wild. All right. Well, we'll take gems, I guess. We're not getting anything else out of that. Ooh, a jolly balloon man. Trapped in the screen. Glassworks. That is tough. I definitely like the Jolly Balloon here, though. He's just a fun guy. And getting him to go with the friendly ghost seems insane. Or even Toby. I guess we don't really want to hit him with Toby because it's he's legendary. Yeah, Balloon Man for tokens, for sure. Enters, create a 4-4 four, four beast token. Can't attack or block alone. No, we do hit Toby. We, we clone Toby, but we keep the original Toby. And we just make 4-4s. Four oh, fear of burning alive with our delirium strat. That's a good top end. Ethereal armor, rotunda is pretty good. I wouldn't mind picking up one glimmer light. We don't, probably don't need found footage. We're taking the, the fear of burning alive, though. That's that's awesome. Um, I don't really want anything out of this. Like the cursed windbreaker, maybe, but I don't want to splash too many blue cards. Innocence with balloon. Oh yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. Balloon man and innocence just gonna be drawing cards like crazy. Uh, winter just to grab it, I guess. We're not splashing for Ripley. Fear of Reduction can be okay. Uh, we're just taking the Dragon Fire. What am I talking about? Dragon Fire. It's like the best removal in the set. Uh, probably want this little guy. Yeah, we're gonna take that little guy. Beads, five color rare. And actually, yeah, nothing else really fits the pack. The orphans kind of does, but we'll take the rare. Go set complete. Oh yeah, all right. Turn inside out. That's a good. Seas from slumber could be pretty decent too as a removal spell. Yeah, we are not going to be slashing you guys, are we? Um, yeah, I'll, I'll take the pump spell, make a 2-2. Two, two. Guess just set complete this uncommon. Oh, uh, what? Trapped in the screen wield? Did we cut white that hard? Nobody else wants the white removal? That's amazing, yes. Give me the other rotunda. Uh, ghost. I don't know that we need three of you. Definitely don't need a healer. A land that doesn't hit a splash for us. Alright, well. 
Yeah, I, I guess I cut white that hard. That was... Woo! Yeah, we don't need ticket booth at that point. Uh, your surveillance will help out. Do we have enough enchantments? There's eight. Nah, I don't know. We might cut the Inquisitive Glimmer. It is a 2 3 for 2. Reduces a lot of costs. Enchantment spells cost less. We can reduce the cost of Roller Crusher Ride. I don't really have a whole lot of non combat sources though. Probably should have grabbed the glass works. At least just one for the the ping on it. Oh man, we can copy hover ships with frickin' the Jolly Balloon Man. Oh, what does the deck look like if we just cut blue? I just what is what does it look like? Right, that's we're just gonna do that. Antagonist, inside out, fear surveillance, delirium guys. We got a couple of creatures that hit both enchantment and artifact, our creature. I guess we would want to play the Terramorphic just to have the ability to get a land into the graveyard. Delirium's gonna be a big payoff. You're really more like a two drop than anything. You really cost four or more. I probably want to hit for like five if I can. I really only got one unsettling twins. It's kind of unfortunate. I don't know. I don't hate it. This looks all right. You know, because then what? This triggers, but we only got. Well, I, I can make enchantments, I guess. I can make enchantment glimmers with the balloon man, huh? Get a copy of a creature. We can make a glimmer or any of our enchantment creatures as a copy and trigger eerie. Oh man, is it really worth the splash for both of you, though? Like, what do I cut for these? Right? Like, what would I cut for those? And I don't have an answer. Like the best thing I could think to cut for these would be these hands that feed. So I guess it would look like that. Cut a ghost, putting back a hand to that that feeds in there because even those are good targets to be one one flyers if i have delirium they become three four flying or three one flying menaces like i just like the friendly ghost because i can copy him and get a one one that gives a another creature plus two plus four and flying you could even just target the one one flyer that i make with it and have a three five flying balloon every turn with the Jolly Balloon Man. Nah, no, nah, we're we're not gonna do that. We're we're just we're gonna stick to what it originally was. The Boro stack. That's that's what we're gonna do.
that was that was a very interesting draft there. But I do think the right play is just to keep the Boros to and under. Enduring and Balloon Man, like there's there's so many good little synergies. I'm a little sad I didn't pick up one of those dolls. But I mean we gonna go one, two, three, be able to attack because I have four creatures. Have yeah, this is good. <laughs> Excuse me. Boros is always the right thing. Interesting. the Terramorphic. That's funny. Um, I might actually just... whatever that was is gone. And now if they want to kill the monkey, that will activate Delirium for us, which is good. Well, surveyor. Man, I'm so glad I went and got double white. Oh, that was so good. I mean, we, we play the innocence, right? Yeah. You want to give me delirium? You're you're a pal. Ooh, there's the tamer. strong for sure uh, one two three four well we can fear of burning alive it next turn I think I'm supposed to play the hand that feeds first to hold up three mana oh no Twins. Oh, that's fine. We can get the. Then we swing, right? Four two menace. That's fine. I'll take all that out. I have another one. That's fine. Get rid of my innocence. Uh huh. Man, I really like the board state right now. Grand Game Treeway, that's fine. I'm just gonna fear of burning alive. Blast you. Get out of here. Same with you and you. <laughs> just a casual eight, you know? for your 1-1. One, one. Well, I don't like that. I 
No, I mean, I probably should have, but I just wanted to clean up the board. game going. <laughs> um, no, we're gonna hit your thing. That's, I'm just gonna get the damage in. Alright, what do you got? Two one one glimmers gonna beat you down going to beat you down. <laughs> All right, game one, Boros wins. That was a good match against the Azorius stuff. Like, it is a very, very strong deck if it can get going. Absolutely. All right. But, I mean, you saw the power of that Rotunda with the, the, like, I, I really almost just want to splash the Gremlin Tamer. I don't know that the Inquisitive Glimmer is worth it, but the Tamer over one that hand that feeds? I think that's okay. If this card gets jammed in my hand, I, I will eat my words. <laughs> Ooh, we get a roller coaster ride. I mean, we have a curve of two, three, four potentially here. So we, we play it out. Yeah, if it's if it's a dead card in my hand and sits there for too long, I will I'll just pull it pull it out. Yeah, we get a curve out fully. This is this is uh maybe not quite, because it only says up to two creatures, huh? I don't know that I want to waste that like that. Strangler, there's the ghost. Uh, let's see if you take it. No, don't want to. All right, interesting. Uh, yeah, and we kind of want delirium before we do that, but. Vessel, okay. Man, there's a balloon man. Woo! And the ghosts. I think we're supposed to twins here. Perfect. Easy choice. Uh, no attacks this time. Devil that you know or the one you don't. Going for the one you do. Interesting. I'd be sending that. 100% I would be sending that. How do we maximize this turn? I think we just friendly ghost, buff the glimmer, and send it. Yeah, 
at least send it all. They're not gonna block. This thing's crazy though, if you can get extra counters on it. It's like that uh, the doll doesn't care what kind of counters, just that it had counters. Meat locker. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna be a little sad. I'm gonna be a little sad. Alright, so I definitely want to trap in the screen here. just gonna get rid of the unwilling vessel like that that's crossed off the list I think I just pass here I want to hold up turn inside out defensively which I really don't but I do this turn just to try and block, kill something, and get a 2 2 back out of it. Um, that's amazing, actually. Okay. Does that mean you're thinking about attacking me? You are. Um, I think we get rid of the vigilance creature. You don't want to sacrifice? You could have sacrificed and dealt damage. Uh, yes. Amazing, and a hover ship. Um, activate only as a sorcery, so I can only balloon man on my turn. go to Midnight Mayhem this turn and attack with just the three life lifers. That gave me Delirium, so now this is activated. But Balloon Man Mothership I think is just going to end the game here. Yeah, that's fine. I'll make the token. Do it. You know you want to. Ooh. Just control the game from here. Oh, go looking. That is a little unfortunate.
How about that opponent? I think Boros wins again. Nah, your weight room isn't going to do anything, unfortunately. Burrower a little bit. But I think we go Balloon Man, fire up the UFO, we Balloon Man the UFO, UFO eats your 5-5, five five. we swing. Yeah, the monkey dupes can be kind of fun because it's a 1-1 one -one flying monkey, but I, I like the uh, the hover ship combo. Definitely. I mean, it didn't slow us down any having that blue splash, so... We play on. Let's see how it takes us. It's there. It's a little slow, but it's there. Ghost vacuum, huh? Well, that's not good. It's gonna eat a lot of my delirium stuff, so... I'll we'll have to see how this, this plays out. This won't get to do Delirium. Ooh, we missed the white for that. That's unfortunate. Deal, but it's fine. Is it a wee? Okay. That is unfortunate that I can't even do that for the one to clear the way. I might just do this now. Uh huh. <laughs> you already know it, buddy. Can't have you messing with my delirium like that. Go ahead and eat one more card. It doesn't really matter. I 
Got no attacks. You'll probably play a creature and get to buff it and swing for three. No, you don't even get to do that. Okay, we're still just no mana drawn. All right, well. Not a whole lot I can do about this. If the mana is not there, I can't play the cards. Enduring tenacity, that's not good. It's a 3-2. I mean, it's not the best. But I can get an upgrade. Boo. Alright, well, we'll manifest the Terramorphic. That's kind of hilarious, actually. Um, friendly Ghost. Just get in for the damage while I can. Yeah, no. I'll take the floor back, that's fine. Oh no, my Terramorphic expands. That's five. That's a little better. Cast Innocence. We'll be able to do the Rotunda and Pump. Alright, well. Had Delirium for all of half a second. That was cool. We can do both here, right? We can go monkey. Oh, we get to draw a card on top of that? That's so stupid. All right, hover ship. Get rid of that. <laughs> How about that? My enduring still on the board. Where's yours? Oh, here we go. Make two, two, twos. Draw two. Oh, I only get to draw one, but still. Um, I probably should have put the other one in there. That would have given me one stop closer. No, no, I don't know if it's the same thing. Um, I can't unlock that. I need one more. Do that though. Um, honestly, if we get delirium going, roller crusher ride right into fear of burning alive is gonna be gross. Especially if I can balloon man any of that. <laughs> roller crusher, fear of burning alive, balloon man. What a combo. Okay. <laughs> The deck seems fire. It's got some synergies. We're doing all right so far. <laughs> that's, that's what this set is about, your synergies. How well did you put your deck together? Luckily for us, we were handed Rare Rare Mythic to start, so our deck is... <laughs> Oh. Now we get to play with the. Uh, what is this? It's so tempting. If this was a red instead of a blue mana, I might do it. Wow. That is rough, but that is keepable. Oh, this is gonna be a rough game. 100%. Hey, activate. Ooh, 
No. What is the start? Oh, we're cooked. We are so cooked. I don't know which one to grab with the hover ship. It's gotta be the scavenger, right? Oh no, look at it go. <laughs> this is gonna suck. This is just because I got this little thing in my deck, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get your damage in. Ooh. Alright, there might be hope. There might be hope. Because if we get to just go hover ship, eat your guy, and then we can just balloon man hover ship. Land enchantment creature f turn inside out will be delirium at that point. Boo! Calamity. No, you don't need an unblockable. It's, it's getting there. It's getting there. Um, I'm just going to take the cheerleader for now. Then for the beats. Not like I was blocking anything anyway. Honestly, I, I had three straight wins. I was expecting to run into somebody with the juice. Oh, this is nuts. We might just die right here. Not quite. Pretty damn close, though. Pretty damn close. Yeah, there's there's not a whole lot uh, going for us here, is there? thing unblockable and win, right? Because... Because if they don't, I take it, but then I don't have enough blockers. That's so lame. So lame. Let's hope it's not uh, three straight wins and just three straight losses. <laughs> like, like I said, I want to hit that four or five wins, you know? Oh no, that's not good. It's not good at all. 
That's a little bit better. I think we are going to keep six and put him on the bottom, but then I immediately get a shuffle to back. Do we just play him right now? He's gonna be such a just wide open target. Yeah, whatever. You gonna counter my balloon man? No, you're gonna plane cycle, okay? Vessel, okay. Friendly Ghost, Balloon Man, and Swing On. Yeah, you ain't trading. <laughs> it's back. Yep, I told you, just shuffle it away. Do the thing, it's fine. Can't cast it yet, but... No, Balloon Man. That's gross. Oh, I wasn't going to block it anyway. Ooh. I got to do the actual creature. That sucks. Why wouldn't you hit the flyer? You're weird. You're weird. What do we got in there? So if we do turn inside out, this gets menace, but only if we do it before we attack. No, uh, we're just gonna end the turn. We're we're on the back foot all of a sudden. This silly blue white deck that people have started putting together. That's first strike. Jesus. We're almost there. If 
five four first strike. land I need to cure that kill that fear of falling Woo! get that out of here That's the four three, but it still got first strike. So we can't. Okay, entryway. I think I just block it with the gremlin. Just win if we attack. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. So two of these are going to get through and I can just pump. First strike. But I'm getting through a six damage. Okay. Cool. <laughs> we win. <laughs> Taken down another Azorius aggro deck with my Boros aggro deck. Woo! <laughs> Alright, little gremlin guy. You, you've earned your keep. The gremlin tamer. That was rough. Very rough. I, I think being able to make the four blockers, though, and be able to swing out like that with the advantage and the pump spell like even if they had something i had protection for the crack back uh turn one turn two mana fix no we got to do this the double planes so we don't get to do the terramorphic and get the friendly ghost on curve because it's going to be clockwork planes planes 
to play the hover ship, possibly. Yeah, whatever. That's good. We'll, we'll we'll play it out. We'll see what happens. Monkey. Another mountain. Well, I guess we get to cast the friendly ghost on curve too. Oh, you're gonna be a little sad. Um, yeah, that's fine, I guess. for a good amount of damage. All right, yeah, murder my ghost. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So what do we do here? We go here, here, <laughs> and here. And we can activate this. Get that. Flying 2-2, two, two, that's so hard to kill. <laughs> Alright, that's all of those castable. What do you got? He costs three, so we can hand. And I got a feeling they're holding something up for the hover ship. I th think I'm just gonna swing the surveil. Artifact, creature, land. I'm gonna exile the hover ship. Okay. You get to manifest. And you get to eat my 1 1 for free. The hand that feeds is potentially getting in for eight next turn. Whew. All right, well, they decided to take care of it. Um, I mean, I know we're gonna manifest dread that, and I don't think that is really what I want. So, no.
monkey. Swing both. Yeah, I kind of need that now. <laughs> now you can't do the thing, that's fine. Trade, trade. Not scared, you're scared. You have this turn to kill me, opponent. I'm not blocking. Activate your tie bar. No? You're gonna try and do it next turn? Okay. So I do think it is... Balloon Man? I can still do it, that's fine. We do have Scorching Dragonfire for the Slasher. Uh, we might have to use it on the Brood Spinner actually just to make sure that the 1-1s can still get in. Swing for 7. We're racing my guy, we're racing. Oh, why didn't you swing with both of those? turn? 
I don't think I can quite kill you this turn. Oh no, I can. Oh no, I'm one short, motherfucker. You don't have a haste. I thought it had haste. Don't know why I thought it had haste. Hey, we got to do it. The Balloon Man wins again. Oh my god. Why is Boros so good? <laughs> Just crushing it. Uh, I still want to do the Balloon Man Fear of Burning Alive with the Roller Crusher. We still haven't gotten to cast this Roller Crusher for anything. <laughs> no, because Balloon Man pumped the token that could attack into a 3-5 flyer, and then the new balloon token has haste and pumps itself into a 3-5 flyer, and I get 6 flying damage that way. Where if I don't balloon man first, I don't really have a whole bunch of flying damage. I mean, it's going to do the thing. We're not going to be able to do it. I mean, I have to keep this, but unfortunately my 2-drop is unplayable, which sucks. You know, because even if I draw the island for it, I don't have the planes for it, so... Um, you want things in the yard, I want things in the yard. Alright, well... He's like, no, I want this faithful to reanimate something. That's fine, my guy. No. Oh no. Do I really need to trap in the screen that? Or do I just wait until he does it to hit the Altenac? To do you do the thing, get your alternac back. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. I'm gonna hit alternac. Hope he doesn't have any enchantment removal to get it back. But yeah, do it. This is the turn to do it, my guy. So scary. Whatever will I do? Yeah. 
Yoink. Yoink. <laughs> What's as cool is this is gonna put something on. We get to manifest dread and draw a card out of this. Oh man. Well, that sucks. I gotta do that. Draw a card, exile a card. Alright, well, we got mana. Unfortunately, lost that, but that has delirium now, right? No. I already had an artifact in there. Damn it. Nah, you can get in for three. Right? So scary. Anyway. You didn't say his name three times. You can't have him. <laughs> you only said his name once. <laughs> oh, there's our six mana. I like that. That's really cool. So if we go friendly ghost... target here there's the balloon man um as long as they control four or more creature tokens creatures i control have flying only got the one that's fine though I think we just swing with our eight damage gain four life exile target enchantment fine you got it We are about to be making 4-4s four galore with Toby and the Balloon Man, just... Uh, turn inside out. <sighs> That's... I guess. Good little two for one. I'm still ahead on board. Yeah, we're just gonna try to make four Toby tokens. This just reminds me of that Monsters Inc. movie. Creature tokens. All right. Well, whatever. Still, if I can get four tokens, I'll have four four flying tokens. Um. Choose the one that you wish to keep. I want to keep the original. <laughs> I 
No. So theoretically, next turn, I can make a copy of Toby, keep the balloon copy, make another 4-4, and I'll have four tokens, three of which will be 4-4 four, four flyers. No, they had the removal. Oh no, that only works on my creatures, my guy. Ward abilities of those creatures don't trigger. This isn't a creature. That was the that was a big oops. Oh, it's the dick twister. Well, that ruins some of this. Block or die. I mean, I wanted to, but they murdered my balloon man. Like, what am I going to do about that? It's fine. Get the land out of the way. Man, you got a really good Jun deck going. A really good Jund deck going. Unfortunately... Is that everything? Oh, cancel. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yeah, no, no, I've got that. I can pay that. One, two, three, four. Pay, auto pay. And then we just go ping, 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 ping. Get in. <laughs> well, that's twice you've said his name. One more time, and you might be able to actually have him. Gotta wait one more. That's 
fine, because the hand that feeds needs to be blocked by two of your creatures. That menace is going to get you. What are the chances that the one card left in their hand is removal? Why am I still just drawing lands? Yeah, we just go for it. The menace is gonna get it. There it is. There it is. even with a dead card in our hand. All right, Boros, final boss. Let's go. <laughs> Let's just open up draft today and, and hammer it out. Oh, man. I don't like it, but we're going to keep it just because we have removal. You have lost teeth, that's fine. I'll make a 1-1 one, one you can kill. We do need to kill that before we play Toby though. Sergeant Eagle Fort, all right. Go, Toby. Ooh, that is rough. That delirium. Please swing for menace. Final Vengeance. Oh my god, they just got it all. Um, what is it? It's exiling the creature, right? Exile target creature. Cool. Well, not a whole lot we can do about that one. Can do about that one. I mean, you can get one or the other.
<laughs> no, you don't get that. I don't I don't I don't think so. I don't like it. have a grip full of cards and we're down to one <laughs> that is not looking great well people have figured out how to put Racto Sacrifice together in this Set. Surprise, surprise. Greatest. I do get in. For what, four? And I get a Manifest Dread. that enough Yeah, we got Delirium. That's fun. I don't know that it's enough. Sacrifice another thing. Ooh, that is just too many inside outs. Good beats. Good beats, opponent. I got stuck on needing double red. It's alright, we got one more attempt. Final boss.
This one we're gonna get to do Balloon Man and the what's it called? Tamer. I think I'm supposed to enduring innocence here. Oh, if you counter this. Wow! <laughs> what? Alright, that's that's fine, I guess. Wild. Fly trap. Tools are going to be rough to be. Yeah, it would have been even nicer if you wouldn't have exiled my enduring whatever. But you did. Sacrifice a creature to it. What a wild delirium deck they got going. Uh huh? I see it. I see it. It's a lot of damage. It's a lot of mana. <laughs> Who? 
Who can outvalue who? Does they have any kind of pump or removal spell? This hurts a lot. But three for one. You just gotta make sure you deal one damage to each of them. to grind through, but I think we've got the setup to do it. Come back, yeah. Balloon, balloon, and Toby is amazing. Yep. Just the value there. <laughs> Just the value of making a four-four every turn. Ah, uh, man. Well, we did it again. Boros beats. That's, that's twice Boros has carried us to a trophy in Duskmorn. Thank you, Boros, for converting my gold to gems. I really appreciate that. That was that was amazing. <laughs> oh, I don't even know what to say. That was such a good run. I should have gone and looked at the deck a little bit more. It was such a good run. Ooh. What is midweek magic? It's only the legends from the last set. And those are the only legal commanders for the brawl challenge, huh? Yeah, no, I, I, I clicked through it too fast. I collect. I didn't even look at my deck. It was just, it was just so good. We just did the thing. That, that was my bad. So, all right. Midweek magic. Know the thrice called Arabella is gonna be crazy. Kaito is probably gonna be good too. Uh, Minira might be fun. Just trying to do the room stuff. Nico is probably good. Norn might be hilarious. Just mono red, one drop. Let's go. Balloon Man could be fun doing the red balloon stuff. But, like, I mean, Valgavoth, but he's sits in your command zone until you can cast him at 9. It seems not great. I bet Zamone is going to be awesome. Just guarantee Zamone on 3 and mana ramp as much as you can in Simic. Okay, I'm probably going to do Zamone for the midweek magic. Well, thanks for seeing the Boros all the way through for the finish. We will see you when you get home. Uh, we might.
might just uh, take a quick break, and then we'll decide if we're building the Brawl deck today or doing another draft.
I apologize for the long break there. It was good timing, though. The dog needed to go out back and puke his brains out, apparently. He has been feeling sick and has kennel cough, so... I'm not sure if it's just him eating something or if that's the kennel cough, but he was puking a lot. Anyway... I really think I should save Midweek Magic for Midweek Magic. And we'll play that tomorrow. Um, but for today, we draft. We draft again. Yes, it's okay to confirm this purchase. This set has been really fun to draft and to play. Even when I'm going 3-3. Boros has treated me nice. That's the second Boros trophy. I would like to draft the Reanimator deck and the Sacrifice deck. I have not really got to play either of those at all yet this set. but I haven't really gotten anything to really push me in those directions as something that I really, really want to do. Uh, Glimmer Seeker is really good. Enduring Tenacity is pretty decent. There's not a whole lot of drain gain stuff unless you're really doing the black-blue uh, enchantment, you know, uh, what is it? The fear of infinity with the life gain, and there's the little, the little two drop thing. I mean, I'm gonna take it. It's a it's a decent rare. I don't know that we're gonna end up being black and playing it, but we'll see what we can make happen with this. I mean, at the very least, it's a four three. You know, it doesn't quite go to the graveyard to count for delirium, but. It can be a card. I mean, let's play a game is decent. Stay hidden, stay silent is just really good. Exercise has been okay. I'm really fond of Glassworks. You know, let's say its name or a patchwork of bestie early is not terrible idea I do think stay hidden stay silent is probably the best card in the pack though even with what we're thinking about doing just because it is an enchantment it'll trigger the eerie things in the Demir deck Exercise is good removal. Let's play a game can be really fun. It is on color if we want to go just mono black delirium. We could get some stick twisters maybe and go that route. I'm not even upset picking a Terramorphic Expanse turn two. Pick two and kind of speculating there. Ooh. Maybe maybe we just pick up let's play a game and we stay black for a little bit. Ah. No, we got Fear of Falling. That's pretty good. Uh, Betrayer's Bargain, Scorching Dragon Fire are also really good, especially if we're thinking about going and doing the Black Sacrifice deck. The Betrayer's Bargain could be really good here. Um, I haven't... Uh, who we could even speculate and just say we're going to be the reanimate deck this time and try and do the reanimate thing. The Orzhov stuff definitely has enough of life gain things, so that would play nice with the tenacity. This can be a really big payoff if I can figure out how to get it into the graveyard and then reanimate it. Yeah, we, we might be playing the reality deck this time. I hope that this Emerge from the Cocoon wheels. Winter's Intervention will be pretty good for us, too, at that point. But let's let's try and pick up and see if we can be the reanimate deck. 
And immediately, like, I mean, the innocuous strat is great, but there is one reanimate spell, boom, in our pocket. And it does the, the game life thing to hit the enduring, so that plays well with that. It might wheel. And at that point, I do want the rat, I think, just a little bit more. No, we'll, we'll be fine. We will we'll pick a merge here. I mean, this Midnight Mayhem or Living Vessel is definitely better cards, but I haven't been able to reanimate yet. And this is, I mean, it's a reanimate spell, reanimate target. So here, this is a little meh. I mean, we get two trapped in the screens. I doubt the second one comes back. Um, we already have four of her, so she's just gems. It's not even something that I really am that interested in trying to make happen. But unable to scream would kept us in the Demir and would have been a really good pickup. Leech could be a good pickup. Uh, just opponent loses life. You don't gain life there, so. Three, four, five. What's this? Creature spells invoke. Each creature in control. Try to stop. Interesting. Not really what we want to be doing, but interesting. Um, I mean, the rat is an okay pickup. It's just buying us time. Really hoping to see like Balgovoth's faithful. A little one drop. Here's everybody gets to discard. We get to draw. That's decent. Possessed goat is also something we're looking for because we we get to discard with that. This is again the rooms pay off. That'd be a rare. If I wasn't getting one of these two cards, I might grab the rare here just to grab it. But it's not something we have to do. Winter's intervention is exactly what I want. I want that life gain. Keeping me in the game. This this is not a bad uh, reanimator deck start. You can kind of see where we go from here. Given to violence might be kind of fun just because of the tenacity. Otherwise, I don't really like playing that card too often. I mean, one is enough. We don't really need another. Another winner's intervention, excellent. Um, we can speculate on a blue splash here. I don't think it'll be necessary. Belmark Leech is okay. I don't think we're doing the found footage thing. Although that could surveil stuff into our graveyard for us. Oh, there was the fear of infinity. That could be really good. There's the emerge to reanimate. Uh, do the glimmer thing. It should be one of these two, and we might splash the blue for the fear of infinity. It is just that good. So let's grab fear of infinity. You know, if we start seeing enough things, we might just ditch the reanimate thing and go back to the uh, the blue life gain. Like fear of lost teeth, no damage, gain a life. I mean, glimmer burst would be good. The draw cards make the glimmer, get my triggers. This is an enchantment in itself. I do like the balustrade worm if we were trying to do the delirium stuff. There's another reanimate spell and live or die. That's pretty decent. Uh, seized from slumber. Winner's intervention. The innocuous row. Things that we'd be looking to do. I'm going to grab the second reanimate spell. We're just going to hope to try and pick up a better couple more reanimate targets as we go uh, speaking of there's a second shroud stopper i think we're just gonna snag that now we don't need to bother with anybody else doing that 
I mean, a second Fear of Infinity makes it a lot more splashable because they loop, they do the life gain thing. They might be a very, very fun loop for us. Um, oh, we can go one more on the reanimate spell. Miasma Demon is an okay target. We might just pick up a Miasma Demon here just to have something else to reanimate. I hope a merge comes back. Here it's probably another Lost Teeth. Cheerleader's pretty good too. And the room just has not been as good as I would like it to be. We could have picked up the land and speculated for a green splash, but I think we're already going blue. There's another Emerge. Final Vengeance. We don't want the Delirium guy. I almost want to take the Dagger Maw for another way to get blue and just as a really good reanimator target. I might speculate on that now while I have the opportunity. See, and I'm rewarded. I get another emerge anyway. Yeah. That's good. Even just getting the one. This is two blue sources for our two infinities. We'll probably get a couple more going. We're not really manifesting. I don't really know that I want to hold up anything to counter. But we don't want any of this, so we'll take the uncommon for gems. Rat is less and less what we want now. Although it being able to manifest dread and throw the bigger things away. It might might turn out well for us there. Let's see if we can't get that uh, sheltered by ghost enchantment. Be able to give one of our better creatures a uh, a little bit of a life gain boost. Um, yeah, I'll probably just take another let's play a game. Two of them seems alright. Each opponent loses life, we gain life. Like, that is what the duck is asking to play, so. Oh man, an unstoppable slasher. It. It isn't exactly what our deck wants to be doing, but it is a very annoying threat that an opponent's going to have to deal with. Absolutely. And this one fills out my arena collection. That is the fourth one. Um, we can grab the land here. There's that Valgavas Faithful that I was looking for. A comeback wrong and a murder. All of that's pretty decent. I don't mind the ethereal armor. But I definitely think I should be taking the Faithful here. And we're going to hope that the land comes back. Oh man, if... I was going to be doing Meat Hook Massacre stuff at any point. I guess this would be the deck to be doing it in, huh? It's an enchantment, so bring back Fear of Infinities. We could hope that that Vile Mutilator rotates all the way back around. Because that is also a very good reanimate target for the deck. But just making sure our things come back. And if you're stuck, yeah, like... I think I want the Neo Massacre. We're going to take the Mythic. You don't get to do it very often. Unless this another Emerge. We could grab a Goat. I think we're supposed to grab the Reanimation spell, honestly. Hunter's Intervention is pretty decent. Uh, we're going to grab the Land here. Hope that the fanatic of the harrowing comes back. But yeah, we want the mana fixing, so we're gonna grab the land. Uh, deals combat damage player. Mill that many cards, put number in any number of legendary or enchantment cards into my hand. 
but no counters this way could have wanted. I mean, that does activate delirium and things. I don't really have enough. Like, I, this is my first one. I haven't even got to play with them. So we can splash him and see what happens. He'll feed the, the, the yard a little bit in that sense. Um, I don't really think we want the third fear of lost teeth, so I'm going to grab the rare here. Uh, fear of falling. That is playable and reanimatable. Interesting. Um, I don't know, maybe a meat locker here just as something to bring back the fears. There's the land we wanted. Uh, Fear of the Dark. Friendly Ghost. Probably some form of flying, huh? Winner's Intervention. Uh, Counterspell. Well, I don't think we're playing either of these. Or that way, and honestly, that's fun though. All right, so we do have a decent chunk here for Reanimator. We can we can take a look at what it looks like without the blue. I mean, that's honestly really good. I don't know that we need to do the Megalodon, the Fear of Infinities. But we could. Oh, I'm mega blocked. How many enchantments? It gives us seven enchantments, two that we just kind of loop. Um, we probably honestly don't want the fear of lost teeth at that point. The goats, the faithful. We don't want to give it to violence. Uh, slasher. Ghost is our one flyer. We didn't really get too many big hits. And I don't have any artifacts, huh? So it'll have to be instant sorcery creature enchantment for delirium. Uh, I guess we could get land. We might be able to get a land in there. Too many ways to get a lot of the stuff back. Like, oh, we go with those two, and we only really need the one island. still black, that's black, that's not, that's, that's just white. So that's what, that's, that's three. That's ten. Still put us at 17 lands, yeah. That looks fine for mana. Tiger Law, my asthma, Shroud Stopper. Yeah, I didn't get any of the black or the white cyclers. I 
just cut one let's play game and go for it. Let's see where this gets us. Uh, unfortunately, without some of the bigger hits, this does look more like a uh, two and three kind of draft deck, which coming down off that Boros trophy high. Keep. We have three of the four for me at hook. We get a turn two rat. Potentially a turn three slasher. Um, yeah, we'll do the blue splash down first. Let's merge. No, we're just we're gonna get the rat down. Interesting. Alright, there's the glimmer light. This was a black man and we could meet hook. Okay, let's get the slasher. To the board. I don't want the rat to die, which is a little unfortunate for me. No, slasher. I think we've got a trapped in the screen that we can do to get the unable to screen to stop, but. Just about it, huh? We would, our one out for that. And then our next mana, we would finally do the thing. What's in the graveyard? Just the creature. Let's put the lamp in there. The enchantment will make it in there eventually. Another new great. One wasn't enough. Double surveil. And do another surveil too. Excellent. Play a Mina Hook Massacre. Might also 
I almost just want to do this and make them discard two cards. Because I kind of want to sacrifice the slasher with a massacre and then emerge it. Yeah, I think we just make them discard two cards. One of them is going to be the infinity for sure. Yeah. Where are you? You're my trapped. No attackers. Okay. You can start pinging in for three. Annoying. Yes, this is the turn. So we want to do it first for just one. That's fine. I'm going to get rid of the slasher. going to decline I take three we have for two more short of just casting stompers, huh? Just slap the slasher down. Block, so you're going to exile him this time. Oh, okay. So I play a rat, and I swing for four. need to get a land. Wow, they would have tools. Tools and dual fear of infinities. That is pretty good. That is pretty good.
Yeah. Uh, we manifest you. I guess I did that wrong. This is pretty good. You got three fears of infinity. And that's not really what we wanted to see. such a good game though dang <laughs> all right well i don't know that the blue splash is completely worth it but they're there Interesting. I mean, we have all of our colors. We have a turn one. They have the vacuum. That is not at all what we want to see. Like, not at all. Exile. Okay. I mean, when you're desperate to blank plays, you are desperate to make plays. You can 
do it again? Oh my god. Holy crap. Alright, well, let's, let's get something to the board, huh? Anything? Maybe? <laughs> Jeez. Alright, we can, we can do that. Gain life, you lose life. And we swing. Alright. Chainsaw, yes. Excellent. <laughs> They're gonna exile it right now. I wish I had the liver die up. Wish I could discard cards with this. We're never really gonna have delirium, so. Is that what I do? Do I just drain their life right now? Or do I make them discard two cards? I think I'm just gonna drain them. Six. We're so close to these Shroud Stompers. Okay. Yep. Yep. Stomper swing. I guess that's silly, it seems. I like the Grixis attempt here, buddy. I do, but.
that's a little unfortunate. Oh, that's great. I think we won. Getting there with Reanimator. It's, it's, it's kind of fun. Even playing through the graveyard hate. <laughs> uh, well, that's pretty cool. I'm able to rank up. Play through that first tier of Platinum. Not a bad day. Yeah, let's hope we can keep it going. Oh yeah, this is this is going to be good. Let's, let's hope this just curves. I do like the uh, moth pattern for the, the city roads. really good. Let's get that out of here. We're just supposed to play the rat here, though. But now we can merge the dagger maw. Use it to look for. That's that is fine. So we go here, here, dagger maw. Cycle, get the one island, play, play a rat. And we swing. And honestly, even if we don't get the next land from a merge, we might just Falgavoth for the Do we slasher or do we faithful for the shark? I think I'm just gonna slasher first. There's no reason to swing the rats at the the two five. I'm trapped in the screen. Okay. Excellent. That is the goat. Well, there's not really anything to discard right now. So yeah, I think we just put the shark to the battlefield and be happy. Unable to scream. Excellent. Okay. Play a 
goats and a fear of infinity. color you're looking for. I see. I see. Activate only once. Oh, and you can block my fear of infinity this way. I see. Okay. I can't gain life. I can't gain life. They just happen to have the one mythic to shut down my deck. As a splash. Cool. We couldn't have milled the Shroud Stomper. We had to hit two lands. That's so frustrating. Just absolutely frustrating. Hello, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. We are not doing so well with the uh, reanimator stuff this time. I mean, I'm up 2-0 right now, but I feel like I'm about to lose this game. Um, that lets me catch the Stomper, though. I just, I don't get to gain life with it, which is like the whole deal. I need to get a draw a card. Uh, I think I was supposed to hold the 0 2 back.
another stomper. Oh, I can only discard two though. Dang. I mean, you got me. If I would have been able to gain life, that would have been 100% my game. I can't believe they had just the perfect splash card to stop me at that point. Any little bit of life gain working in my deck would have been amazing. have anything going on other than Vagavoth's Faithful. It's a lot of high expensive stuff. I got a mulligan that. Yeah, that looks so much better. Sorry, my asthma, you gotta go back in. Uh, definitely go. Well, also that. And I will not offer my goat for your rat. to trade. Okay. How about now? need to get enduring down and flip that and that's four damage a turn there's another one that's silly Trade? One trade. Yeah. Nice. Sorry you couldn't flip yours up. <laughs> uh, thanks for doing the thing for me. Nice. Deliver, huh? I 
kind of need that thing to die. We can race. Uh huh. What else you got, opponent? What else do you have? with the fear but fear and tenacity I'll make a big beater that's fine I think we win we're just gonna kill the chandelier swing for four drain for two more to the minimum 3-3 three, three. let's see if we can make this a positive run I'd be happy with even four or five I don't need a full trophy the immortal sun alright well it's not the prettiest, but it is playable. You go a rat into fear. Okay, opponent. 
have you found the stream? You, you getting in? No, you're just carting. All right, swamp, go. Water tunnel seems legit. <laughs> I want to manifest dread of home. That was perfect. Ooh. And if I do this right, we can do it next turn. I really kind of wanted to get... I think I'm gonna get friendly ghosts down anyway. Get in for the four life gain while I can. Thinking about pumping and swinging an opponent, I will double block. That is a thing I am capable of doing. It's a good place to be, I feel. I don't know that you can you can flip. You can go to five over there, potentially. I won't be able to do anything about that if that face down card is anything. So we might just chump. Try and keep the friendly ghost alive. Um you're not getting through that way. Let's let's do that. See how much this hurts. I'm bashful. That's another emerge. That's friggin' amazing. Alright. My stomper. Land. Two. <laughs> I 
that opponent. That's a good card. It turns all your manifest dread into draw a card instead. I'm not trading. If you swing for five, I'm gonna hold back. Swing? No? Okay. Well. It was interesting to see, I guess. We'll do this. Oh, the me hook. I can't cast it though. I'm one short. That's unfortunate. But if we do get me hook, we can oh we can cast it for two and make them lose two. And that's a big swing back. Go ahead, hit me. sound opponent I'm still in this game slasher. Well, we just play the goat as a little a little guy. Okay. I draw a black mana source. I think we can win next turn. There's not a black mana source. Oh, 
So if we would have been able, if we would have had the black mana source, I would have been able to sack the shroud stomper, and then pay the life to bring it back. I don't know that I'm going to be able to do that now with the Mihook Massacre. That, that'll do it? Question mark. Oh no, they had another one. I was I was hosed no matter how I blocked. That's funny. We needed that black mana. Damn, that was a close game. Three and two. Three and two. the mana we got removal we could manifest oh, we definitely got removal that's that's awesome um we might just kill that now I get a black mana. that black man and I'm gonna be so upset Turn it face up and then swing. Hit you for eleven. What do I need? I've got instant creature land. Slasher. Let's do it. Chainsaw. So we're going to kill this now so that it doesn't rev. Okay. 
I don't want to gain the life about it. I'll put a sorcery and give me delirium for the next turn. Yeah, I do. I do. Well, let's get the slasher back. I think you lose some life. Uh, no attacks. We have lethal with let's play a game. They lose three life. We gain three life. They lose three more. thoughts opponent you, you think you have some trick up your sleeve <laughs> uh, reanimator when it works it's great it's super fun thing we are going to be net positive with the reanimator deck with four and three fun. It'd be a little more fun if I had some better reanimate targets, but uh, the, the life grind to get there is is working, so um, you know, we don't really have the way to discard you, Shroud Stomper. I get to do uh, Innocuous. And pray. We will mulligan once. Oh, that was that was a terrible, terrible idea. We'll mulligan twice. Yeah, we'll keep five. We'll get rid of you. <laughs> I mean, I can't just keep all the lands. You don't even get anything because the island's gone, so yeah, we'll do that. I mean, it is about time to lose, huh? Oh no. Not like this, Dak. Come on. You're so much better than this. Can we get a rat to trump block that? That would have been... No, we're just going to get more mana. Oh no. I don't like this. This isn't good. And it's better than nothing. Rest. Oh, pretty good. But I'm going to. I'm 
There's the rats, you bastards. Rat bastards. Alright. Let's get something good in the graveyard, huh? Uh, yeah, my asthma demon's pretty pimp. to do that the other way. That's funny. Cocoon, the miasma. Discard two. I'll kill you and you. That's it. If you can kill my shit, you win. <laughs> Alright. away from a shroud stopper which is what I discarded okay okay Life, drain you for two. I use surveil. I take five down to nine. As soon as we draw a land, we're dead. Yes. I'll uh, drain you for some. you doing come on uh, I would but we can't it would have been really good if we could have but four and three the animator <laughs> 
Not the best deck I have played by far, but it was one of the funner ones for sure. Alright, let's claim that and grab our, our gems, our packs. Not bad for spending 100 gems, that was pretty fun. Alright, well, we're going to uh, do the Brawl deck. Um, so, commanders are built 100 card using MDG Arena. Is the only restriction the commander for this? Yeah, it looks like it. So, we'll do the thing, we get to build a deck. And honestly, it's either. Marina or Zamone. Yeah, Agamemnon Slayer. Agamemnon was faithful. His onslaught. All of those are in there. Another one door. Artifacts and creatures entering don't cause abilities to trigger. Interesting. Yeah, ghostly dancers. That's that's what I want. I want just a room, not door. Room. A scavenger. Dollmaker shop. Unwilling vessel. Key bearers. Um, yeah, meat locker's fine. Elevator will be there. I guess we'll just want to play a few more of those. The annex will be great. The crypt will be great. The funeral room will be awesome. That'll be good. You'll be decent. Yeah, glassworks, painters. Another than pay mana cost for a spell cast from exile, huh? Yeah, that seems alright. Greenhouse. Gym. Strip office. Fear of infinity? No, we don't need that. Keys of the house, the smoky lounge, the roaring furnace. Uh, black and white. Oh right, it's the whole set of everything. Um, so what do I want? I want moth, right of the moth. Yeah, right of the moth. Well, um, or die. Really? I gotta put you in quotation marks to find you? Let's live. Live or die. Oh, that gets me there. That's that's great. Um, emerge. Squirming emergence will probably be good. Um, that's probably good in here. Dance. That's the manse will be good. Um, Dual land 
lines are going to be just key for this. Anything that enters untapped, I think, is going to be good for us. Oh, I need the fast mana necessarily so we can get the slow lands. I'm just going to put that in there because it says tap all creatures my opponents control. That's insane. Two or fewer, deal some damage, tap, gain two life. That's fine. Control effect to the swamp. Just control two or more other lands. That would be easy. Giant creature has two plus two flying and lifelink. Yeah. Two or fewer other lands, no. More more lands. That's fine. The basics. Skies, surveil, deal of damage, tap, search my library for an instant or a card with flash. Uh, I don't think we'll need that. Halfway, deal of damage. Hey, how we doing? I'm doing well. Uh, the stream has been pretty decent. We we had a, a positive draft, got a full trophy. Second draft kind of only went in, uh, got 4-3, but you know. Type my Discord in chat so you can add me. Can, can I ask why it has to be on Discord? And why there's so many Discord artists on Twitch. Just has to be on, on on Discord though. You want my Discord? So that's a fun me card.
Well, we don't want to talk no more? I'm willing to talk about it. I just, you're, you're not the first person to come in and demand my uh, Discord so you can send me your art. And I'm just curious as to what what this is all about and why there's so many of you doing it. Like, it can't be that lucrative and to come harass me and my one other viewer to, to bug me about your art. <laughs> See the things I have to put up with when you're gone. No, I don't want the fewer ones. Damn it. Copperline Gorge. Get out of there. It sounds like we will be seeing you shortly. like the other one that's silly Site seems okay. Already got dance. No. Sure. That scene was good. all the enchantment stuff yeah, Tameshi you're going to be in for an aura a god or a demigod no that, that's not going to 
cut it. Um, I want a Nico. Ooh, not collected. No, don't want that then. Uh, no, I don't think we want to go that route. Enchantments into your hand. That's the one at the bottom of my library in a random order. Um, the life's bounty might be okay. Should just do the thing against their commander. Um, enchant, wait, or enchant means hex proof and indestructible. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Just want it to cost one or two, I think. That way we can kind of skim the top stuff. Oh yeah, for each artifact on enchantment I control. All that glitter's for sure being in there. Um, Some of these are just not that good, huh? Glyph and elemental. Put a land on it, bestow. No, that doesn't seem that good. Michiko's is fine. Shelter is probably okay. I need to get the, like, turn your creatures into things with no abilities. It's like unable to speak and things like that. Why am I going backwards? Unable to scream. Witness protection. What else removes abilities along those lines?
Frogify. Kazmina's. Some dual. Slay the Hall Creeper might be all right, just because it's an enchantment. Uh, Stasis Field. Just going to be an annoying deck. I don't think there's any black cards like that that we want. We might come back for a couple of reanimate things, though. They cost a little bit more than what I'm looking at right now. Red doesn't remove any abilities. Green's got a couple though. Green's definitely got a couple. Wow, Riveting Rituals. Pretty legit, huh? What a card. You know, Keith, you may cast a permanent spell from your hand with mana value equal to one plus the highest value among other permanents you control if you don't scry one. There's all these super interesting cards. All right, there's the transformation. Um, probably want swords. Oh. Interesting. I have all of the Swords of Plowshares card styles, but I haven't actually gotten the swords. Can we make it just an uncommon? I don't have that. Wild. Um, man, what is that card? Seven. Reduced by oh, we could do some domain things. Alley line binding. Maybe even a drag to the bottom. Tribal flames. counter on it.
it. Alright, well we don't want that. We're not really doing that. There's just a whole lot of shenanigans in here. Where am I out on my land count? 40 lands. That's about right for a 100 card deck. I don't have a whole lot of actual mana fixing though. I didn't really want to build a super good deck though. And we got a door deck. We're gonna build one more. Uh, go brawl. Zone. Start pretty much in here in the multicolored blue stuff like this, the Simic blue stuff. And we can just start adding really good Simic cards to this. Yeah, the Pummeler will be fun. Aeronaut maybe with some domain stuff. Double major would be just fun. Some gross spiral. I don't know that I want to manifest anything. I did not do pet dinner. Nope. Man's in there. No, don't go backwards. Go this way. Thank you. Just play all the Zamone, that's fine. Draw a card for each different power of one creature as you control. We can do the open ratio. We'll, we'll make a math deck. Quandrix Prodigy and Double Major and it'll be silly. Slime might be fun. Uh, enters his counters. Arm cast on the counter. Yeah, that could be fun. Oh, you want to awaken the woods, huh? We can we can put the woods in here. Dark 
freezer. Uh, yeah, that doesn't matter. Ether Helix is good. No, you guys are not. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do the the lands thing with Primo and just keep making lands. Oh yeah, Bonnie Paul, Potty of Research. Doppelgang, Fractal Summoning, Hydroid Repulsive, Goose. Altered Ego is going to be fine. We'll add a bunch of Dual Lands. Probably going to go through and cut most of these. would be great. Awaken the woods. Uh, what's the thing that makes all my stuff into lands? Uh, probably want a code Dama. from your graveyard. Now a walk-in closet. You may cast spell a graveyard this turn. Put a graveyard from anywhere. Oh, I haven't gotten that yet. That's fun. For an island, you work. Forest for planes, that doesn't. All right, command tower. Evolving Wilds, Fabled Passage. Oh, definitely Field of Ruin. Uh, 
Let's control your search for a basic land, put all that up in a shuffle. Yeah, I know we don't want to do that. I want mine too. Honestly, this is okay already, I think. I don't know that I need any of these other extras in here. We just need to get some good uh, green-blue cards. counter as well. Lessons capture. Creeper. Fire strangers as well. Seems good. Oh, we're not doing an elf thing. That's gonna be a great one. Deals to power to check the future of my plans are for you don't control. That's a good one. Hard hitting city 
this fungus. Poison's gonna be good. Well, treatment should be decent. so many cards in magic how do we remember these Here we've got the landfall, we got the things. Uh, creatures are lands. Um, yeah, why can't I think of that card? Creatures are lands in addition. Duplication. Oh yeah, it did, it did, it did slagged terribly. You're a little behind on that.
Honestly, I probably don't need the excavator. Where's that goofy door at? Oh no, I didn't add the goofy door in. Probably what the essence capture. We don't need to capture a creature. Play styles and hit done. Oh. That's great. There it is. All right. I don't know that I'm going to do them tonight, but we now have the doors and the maps. We, we've got two decks to, to play in this brawl challenge for midweek magic tomorrow. So. But I do think, oh man, we're so close there. Two, two drafts, pretty decent drafts. Both drafts weren't positive. We're up gems today. We're set for tomorrow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it a stream here. It was a good time. And uh, we will do midweek magic and a couple more drafts tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out. Catch you guys tomorrow.